It's a massive stone pillar. If my eyes don't deceive me, it's slightly taller than the distance between the two sides of the gorge. Several stones are loose at the bottom of it, on the side facing the gorge. I know it sounds crazy, but can't you use that pillar at the gorge as a bridge? All you need to do is move the loose stones at the bottom of it. Blow it up for all I care. Hmm. Could work. I'll look into it. If I'm going to move this thing, I'll need more than simple tools. If I'm going to move this thing, I'll need more than simple tools. The bridge was torn down. I don't think I can use it to get down to the ledge. The remaining cable isn't long enough. It's a portable pylon for rigging bridges. I think it's used by the military. It's too wide. I can't even jump it. There's a corpse on the ledge. Poor guy must have fallen down there when the bridge was destroyed. I can see a cargo container too. It's too dark down there. I can't see a thing. If I throw something down there, it has to be something that emits light. I don't want to mix it with that. I don't want to mix it with that. If I throw something down there, it has to be something that emits light. I don't want to stink that up. That doesn't need leverage. That makes no sense. That doesn't need any scooping up. It's too wide. I can't even jump it. I'm no bomb expert, but you've got carbon in the filter. Saltpeter in the sand, and sulfur in the insecticide. Mix those, and you've got yourself some gunpowder. Maybe you could use that to topple that stone pillar. I'm no bomb expert, but you've got carbon in the filter, saltpeter in the sand, and sulfur in the insecticide. Mix those, and you've got yourself some gunpowder. Maybe... I've placed the CO2 filter with the gunpowder in it at the base of the pillar, deep in the sand, and then packed it down with several large boulders.
Wow, I must admit, I did not expect that to work. Looks like someone tried to build a bridge here. It's unclear whether they succeeded before it was destroyed. The pylon's a bit loose, but I think it can hold my weight if I can use something thin to descend. That's not gonna help me get down to the ledge. This one already has the remains of the bridge tied to it. Unfortunately, I can't go down to the ledge on this. I can't go down until I have rope or something I can tie onto the free pylon. I wouldn't dare use the remains of the bridge. Now you can walk to the other ship. Powder Novak. Are you seeing this? Yep, looks bad. It seems to have been ripped apart. It's possible they were caught in the same gravitational disturbance as we. But this looks like a Taurus class cruiser, the big sister of our morning star. Yeah, about that anomaly. Did you scan for it? Yep, but the computer is unable to pinpoint its location. All we know it's somewhere on this planet, and we need to get rid of it to take off. Otherwise, we'd be doing this all over again. Got it. I'll take a look around inside. Maybe I can find out what happened to these people. It must have been an attack cruiser, but this gun array is now useless. No point in that. No point in that. It says Armstrong. The ship was torn in half by the gravitational forces. As I said, it gets in everywhere. Let's not bury things in the sand, okay? Let's not bury things in the sand, okay? It says M. Coulter. That's the wrong card. It says V. Dirtle. That's the wrong card.
It says S. Mendez. I don't want to go back there. It looks dangerous, what with the ship being torn in half and all. I can't open the lock with that. 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 The door is stuck. I think it's the hydraulics again. The control panel has no power. The wiring has rusted. So there's no way I can supply power to this unit. Better go with brute force again. That may have worked on our ship, but this lock is damaged beyond repair. I need to take another shot at this with something more powerful. That shot has melted the control panel and the control mechanism behind it, but the door is still closed. I think I'll have to force it open. That shot has melted the control panel and the control mechanism behind it, but the door is still closed. I think I'll have to force it open. I managed to force the door open with the rod. Without the hydraulics holding it in place, it was relatively easy. This log contains the coordinates of a camp in that canyon. I've removed the coupling. The plasma injector is still there. The cable is tied firmly to the pylon. I can now rappel down. 
but the cable's only long enough to get me down to the ledge below. It's a large boulder. I can almost go around it to the back of the wall. See if you can locate that camp on the map that was mentioned in that marine log. Creepy as always, it's as if it were standing guard. But I'm sure that's just my imagination running wild. Mm -hmm. log mentions a distress call that one of their crew sent out from a crater. That should put the source in this area. It's a grave. The rifle on the headstone is useless. It might be a good idea to dig it up, but with my bare hands, it could take hours. It's broken beyond repair. I have no use for it. I don't think so. He has nothing more on him. Its lid is all bent up and crooked. It looks like it took a shot or was dropped from up high. I can't open it by hand. Its lid is all bent up and crooked. It looks like it took a shot or was dropped from up high. I can't open it by hand.
That doesn't need leverage. That doesn't need screwing. Everything else in it is smashed. Nothing there. I don't want to go back there. It looks dangerous, what with the ship being torn in half and all. That's still a huge area to cover on foot. I won't go there until I know exactly where the distress call is coming from. I have located a distress beacon at that small crater. There's hundreds of these things, and they're all facing that ledge. Okay, I'm officially declaring this the creepiest thing on the planet, for now. Man, this door is huge. Something tells me I'm gonna get answers in there. I don't want to frame that. I don't want to tie the rope to that. That could work but I'm not doing anything until I have some idea about what's inside. There's nothing else there. It's a massive steel door and it's shut course.
try exploring the gorge even deeper. It's a large boulder. I can almost go around it to the back of the wall. I don't want to put that on the boulder. I don't want to put that on the boulder. I don't want to put that on the boulder. I should be using this on something that can fly. I don't want to attach the wires to that. I don't want to locate that. I already know where it is. I don't want to wind the wire around that. I should be using this on something that can fly. You should try exploring the gorge even deeper. I already took all the insecticide I need. I managed to rig it with the energy cable. This one already has the remains of the bridge tied to it. Unfortunately, I can't go down to the ledge on this. I don't want to go down there until I have some safe way to descend and can see something. It seems pretty deep. I don't want to throw that down there. I have tied the rope around the boulder. I've got the rope in place, but it's still too dark down there. I have activated the plasma flare and have thrown it down over the edge. I hope there's enough light down there now. Great. All the rope I want, now that I don't need it anymore. It's glowing nice and red. Let's not disturb them, okay? 